You have a new text message. Say read or cancel. Read. No, we're just going off to my friend Matt's house to um, get some of our gun stuff ready. Um, getting ready to go shooting. I've always had an interest in guns. Uh, I used to have um, just an airsoft pistol when I was younger, uh, just firing little plastic BBs around. Big fan of paintballing. I've always wanted an air rifle. Um, mostly in the week we go to James's just because it's uh, convenient to go because it's literally on our doorstep, just around the corner. Um, we also go to Oak Hanger Fishing Pits, sort of on the way to Old Sager through the back lanes. Um, it's a massive permission there. There's just acres and acres, fields and fields, so much land, and uh, we normally have quite a good shoot when we go there. We get quite a lot of rabbits because we can just split up and go into each field. Uh, me and my friend Matt will take one field, and then our friend Nathan he'll go off into the other field, and we normally have quite a successful night when we go. Most nights sort of ranges from three to about ten. Uh, we we normally get one each without fail. We yeah. have pretty good nights every time we go. That was in June. Yeah. It is legal for me to have my gun in the back seat because it's a bit of a Obviously, it'll take some explaining to do if I ever got stopped um, with the firearm in my car. Because police treat firearms all the same, no matter what it is. Night vision benefits me in the field massively, just because they can't see me when I when I've got this on. I can just stand there in the dark, point and shoot. It's as simple as that. How could you hurt a cute innocent bunny? But I don't see anything wrong with what I'm doing. If anything, I sort of see hunting rabbits as pest control. I feel like I'm helping the landowner. I feel like I'm doing them a favour because. It benefits me and my friends, but it also benefits them because um, James, for example, he has horses. If the rabbits are digging holes and the horse puts his leg in a hole and breaks his leg, then you've got to, you've got to kill the horse because there's no there's just no way the horse is ever going to be the same. Like. No more. Yeah, I'm just driving slow because I don't want to make too much noise and scare the rabbits away. Port behind is um, discovery. Can you have any other way? I know, yeah. But I decided I can't wear black whenever, whenever I come round. Because their fur gets all over my clothes. <laughs> Rabbits pick up on any sort of noise like that and they just scarper. Just the aim is to be as dark or as stealthy and as quiet as possible. So if I aim at this uh, chalk target here, I want the chalk target, I'll just pop these down. I need the chalk target to be slap bang in the middle of the cross. If my gun zeroed in, my gun should fire straight through the middle of that cross. Some more time ahead of us. <laughs> Might get lucky. <sighs> so after scouting like, through the first paddock down at the front of the house and just taking a quick trip up this paddock, it's uh, looking pretty unsuccessful at the moment. It doesn't seem to be many out. Why is that? I don't know. I think I put it down to the cold weather. Um, they're warm blooded, aren't they? So 
Obviously they're gonna stay on the ground, stay warm. Uh, might be lucky, you might see a couple if we go over to this fence over, over here. Yeah. Um, there's another field over there, but I think tonight possibly the rabbits might win this one.